Hello everyone, this is your German teacher Erhan Özdemir from Istanbul, Turkey. In this lesson, we are going to learn die Sehenswürdigkeiten. Die Sehenswürdigkeiten stands for landmarks or the places of interest. Let's get started. When I say what is this, I'll say was ist das? Was ist das? I try to draw Brandenburger Gate. Okay, Brandenburger Gate. I don't know if you know this, Brandenburger Gate is in Berlin and Berlin is the capital of Germany, right? So uh, I need to ask what is this? So this stands for was ist das? Was ist das? What is this? This is uh, Brandenburg Gate. I'll say das ist der Brandenburger Tor. This is the Brandenburg Gate, which is das ist der Brandenburger Tor. So the next question is, where is the Brandenburg Gate? So I'll say, wo ist, right? Wo stands for where. Where is Brandenburg Gate? I'll say, wo ist der Brandenburger Tor? Wo ist der Brandenburger Tor? Where is the Brandenburg Gate? As I mentioned before, it is where? In Berlin, right? So I'll say then, der Brandenburger Tor ist in Berlin. The Brandenburg Gate is in Berlin, which is der Brandenburger Tor ist in Berlin, right? The next question is, wo liegt Berlin? Liegen means to lie, but here it means location. Where is Berlin located? Wo liegt Berlin? Where is Berlin located? Wo liegt Berlin? So I'll say Berlin is located in Germany, right? And Germany stands for, for Deutschland. So I'll say Berlin liegt in Deutschland. Berlin is located in Germany. Berlin liegt in Deutschland, right? I want you to repeat after me, please. Was ist das? Was ist das? Das ist der Brandenburger Tor. Das ist der Brandenburger Tor. Wo ist der Brandenburger Tor? Wo ist der Brandenburger Tor? Der Brandenburger Tor ist in Berlin. Der Brandenburger Tor ist in Berlin. Wo liegt Berlin? Wo liegt Berlin? Berlin liegt in Deutschland. Berlin liegt in Deutschland. Let's continue with the next landmark. The next landmark is, I tried to draw here, the Colosseum, uh, which is in Rome, in Italy. I don't know if you know this, but yeah, it's a nice place. So if I ask, what is this? I'll ask for was ist das? Was ist das? Which stands for was. What is this? Right? So if I say this is the Colosseum, I'll say das ist das Colosseum. Das ist das Colosseum. If I ask where is the Colosseum? Where is the Colosseum? I'll ask for wo, right? So wo stands for where. Where is the Colosseum? Wo ist das Colosseum? As you see here, Colosseum has the article das. So we can skip das article. We need to use das article with das Colosseum. Okay? So where is the Colosseum stands for wo ist das Colosseum? Okay? And as the Colosseum is in Rome, I'll say das Colosseum ist in Rome. Das Colosseum ist in Rome. So, if I ask, where is Rome located? Where is Rome located? Rome is located in where? Yeah, in Italy, I suppose that you know this. So, I'll ask for, wo liegt Rome? Wo liegt Rome? Where is Rome located? Wo liegt Rome? Rome is located in Italy. I'll say then, Rom liegt in Italien. Rom liegt in Italien. 
I want you to repeat after me, please. Was ist das? Was ist das? Das ist das Kolosseum. Das ist das Kolosseum. Wo ist das Kolosseum? Wo ist das Kolosseum? Das Kolosseum ist in Rom. Das Kolosseum ist in Rom. Wo liegt Rom? Wo liegt Rom? Rom liegt in Italien. Rom liegt in Italien. Let's continue with another landmark. Here I tried to uh, draw das Hagia Sophia Museum. Hagia Sophia Museum, I don't know if you know this. Hagia Sophia Museum is located in Istanbul in Sultan Ahmed in Turkey and it's a really beautiful place. I strongly advise you to visit this place. So if I want to ask what is this, I'll ask was ist das? Was ist das? Okay, so uh, in German when I mention a museum because this is uh, a museum, das Museum. So I need to put the article das Museum and the name of the museum is called das Hagia Sophia Museum. So I need to have this structure das Hagia Sophia Museum. Okay, so if I say this is the Hagia Sophia Museum, I'll say das ist das Hagia Sophia Museum. Was ist das? Das ist das Hagia Sophia Museum. So when I want to ask where is the Hagia Sophia Museum, I'll ask for wo, right? For where stands for wo. Wo ist das Hagia Sophia Museum? Where is the Hagia Sophia Museum? Wo ist das Hagia Sophia Museum? As I mentioned this before, it is in my hometown, which is Istanbul. I'll say then, das Hagia Sophia Museum ist in Istanbul. Das Hagia Sophia Museum ist in Istanbul. Okay, so if I say, how is Istanbul? In German, I mentioned this before, for how, I'll say wie, right? So, wie stands for how. How is Istanbul? Wie ist Istanbul? Istanbul is very beautiful. So, beautiful stands for schön. Very beautiful stands for sehr schön, right? Schön, beautiful. Sehr schön, very beautiful. So, when I say Istanbul is very beautiful, I'll say Istanbul ist sehr schön. Istanbul ist sehr schön. So, when I want to ask where is Istanbul located, I'll ask wo liegt Istanbul? Wo liegt Istanbul? Where wo liegt to be located in Istanbul? Wo liegt Istanbul? Istanbul is located in Turkey, I want to say this. But as I mentioned this before in the previous uh, lesson, I mentioned about the countries, the, the videos. Uh, for those who didn't watch the video, I strongly recommend you to watch that video because there is a changing in the article. This is same here. The article D changed to der and this is actually called dative form in German. So the dative is also here in this uh, sentence structure because there is in. So as I say, Istanbul liegt in. Türkei has an article which is die Türkei, other from uh, the other countries. Uh, Türkei needs to have the article D. So if I want to say uh, Istanbul is located in Turkey, I need to change this to what? There. Why? Because I have the preposition in. Just like ich komme aus der Türkei, right? I uh, mentioned that in that video, countries and nationalities, 
uh, I strongly recommend you to watch that video as well. So there was a changing here as well in the Türkei. So I need to have this as a structure. We will be having this in details in the next videos, but now I want you to have this as a structure. I can't say in the Türkei, that would, wouldn't be correct. I need to say in the Türkei, right? But uh, Turkey alone stands for the Türkei. So if I say Istanbul is located in Turkey, I need to say Istanbul leaked in the Türkei. Istanbul leaked in the Türkei. And the question to that would be what? Who leaked Istanbul? Where is Istanbul located? Who leaked Istanbul? Istanbul is located in Turkey. Then I need to say Istanbul leaked in the Türkei. I want you to repeat after me, please. Was ist das? Was ist das? Das ist das Hagia Sophia Museum. Das ist das Hagia Sophia Museum. Wo ist das Hagia Sophia Museum? Wo ist das Hagia Sophia Museum? Das Hagia Sophia Museum ist in Istanbul. Das Hagia Sophia Museum ist in Istanbul. Wie ist Istanbul? Wie ist Istanbul? Istanbul ist sehr schön. Istanbul ist sehr schön. Wo liegt Istanbul? Wo liegt Istanbul? Istanbul liegt in der Türkei. Istanbul liegt in der Türkei. In this video, we have learned the Sehenswürdigkeiten. I hope you enjoyed it. I want you to subscribe to our channel, leave comments, share this video with those who want to learn the German language and hit the bell button for further more videos. See you in the next video. Tschüss!